In this video, we're going to be looking at purchases and the VAT implications for your purchases in Zero. We'll also refer back to your VAT settings just to recap on what you should be doing there. So let's look at VAT and purchases. Your VAT will already be set up in Zero, but just to recap where you do that, it's settings, general settings, and then financial settings. And if we go to the VAT scheme and we choose the drop down, here we can see the different types of VAT scheme that you can have. The accrual scheme is the standard scheme for VAT. That would mean that you can claim VAT on all your VATable purchase invoices and your VAT is reclaimed based on the date of those bills. On the cash scheme for VAT, this was set up designed to ease cash flow for small businesses. You can still reclaim VAT on all your purchase invoices, but in this instance, your VAT is reclaimed at the date that you make your payments. This scheme is really more helpful on the sales side of things because it means that you don't pay VAT on sales invoices until you have actually been paid. So the reason for this scheme is to help you if you're struggling with cash flow. The flat rate scheme is meant to simplify VAT for small businesses. If you're on the flat rate scheme, you do not claim VAT on any purchase invoices. So you would enter all your bills in zero with no VAT. There is an exception if you've got certain assets that you purchase that are over £2,000. What happens instead on your flat rate scheme is you simply pay over to HMRC a set percentage of your sales and that percentage is based on the industry, the type of business that you have. And of course, there will be the instances where your business is not registered for VAT. If your sales are under the threshold, which is currently in 2017, £85,000 per year, you don't have to be registered for VAT. If you're not VAT registered, you will not be claiming VAT on any purchase invoices, so everything in zero will be entered as no VAT. Here's an example of a purchase invoice in zero where the VAT is 20% VAT on expenses. This example would be if you are on the standard scheme or if you are on the cash scheme. And here's what the same bill would look like this time if you are on the flat rate scheme or if you're not VAT registered. In this instance, you will see that the tax rate is no VAT and the amounts are now including the VAT because the VAT is now a cost to your business. So if you're VAT registered, the cost in this line to your business would be £200 because you're claiming back the £40 VAT. But when you're not VAT registered or if you're on the flat rate scheme, the cost to your business is 240 because you're not reclaiming the VAT. As always, if you like my videos, please let me know that you like them. And why don't you subscribe to the channel so you get notified when new videos are uploaded each week. Until next time, happy zeroing.